you guys haven't seen us in about probably five or six months now. It's been a while. But here's the fun part. We were in winter our last one, now we're in summer. Here's the funny thing. Here's this arm. There's that arm. I don't know if you can see the comparison. Red, pale. Red, pale. Trucker's tan, that's what it's called. This is the uh, outdoor window. Oh my god, that's hot weather says. This is amazing. So, John, you want to pick up from there? Well, as you can tell by the belly rub, we, uh, we had a, um, a movie night and we played uh, a drinking game to Inception. Every time they said anything about sleep or dreaming, we drank and we plowed through about 15 beers between the two of us in about an hour. Yeah. Two. And it's a long movie, so imagine what we managed to do after that. <laughs> oh, you wanna, you wanna, do you remember why we haven't done an episode in so long? Uh. Well, my laptop exploded. And this guy had shoulder surgery. And he had surgery. You can see one of the scars right here. I took him to the Hobdable, and mm -hmm. then I got to get his pills for him, and they thought I was a pill head. <laughs> <laughs> but what we're going to make today is we're going to make some jerk chicken, and we're going to make some uh, corn on the cob, because it is finally in season to make some corn on the cob. Mm. John is going to do one to uh, show the crowd how you're supposed to do it. Uh, corn. Best way to tell, you want to make sure that the stalk is very firm. You know, the leaves don't pull off easily. Garbage is on your right. The, you, you want to make sure they're nice and strong. And then, of course, you want to check their color if you just look through the tip. And uh, this should be, uh, once you get on the inside of the stalk, it should be that whitish, greenish type of color. And once you check, it should be nice and yellow right on the inside. I pray to God that's not the video that. Oh, here. This is what Ponch bashes we are. Natty Light. Mm -hmm. We are broke, son. Yeah. Or more specifically, me. I. Okay. If anybody tells you to join an insurance company, you tell them to fuck off. Anywho, salt the water. Oh, yo. Here's another thing, too. Are you uh, stable enough to lift up one of your feet? Maybe. <laughs> Summer! <laughs> I'm not gonna attempt that. It's not gonna happen. And sugar. Sugar on the corn. Uh, it makes it ridiculously sweet. Hope you all like cavities. Mm. Or at least don't care like Holy I do. Holy diver. Really? Alright, so cut your corn on the cob in half. Uh, mostly because it's easier to fit inside the pan. Sharpen your knife for this one. Holy you need a sharper one? No, it's fine. Dude, you got like three fourths and a quarter on that one. Perfect. Perfect. I almost killed myself. Into the water we go. That's the scary part. Watch out. <laughs> scary. See? Point in case. I haven't cooked in a while. Alright. That's all set. Let it go for a little bit. Dude, there's starch in that though. That's gonna foam out of the side. Yep, go ahead and take that right off. <laughs> <laughs> I was kind of thinking so, but hey, whatever. Let's see, you can tell this isn't gonna be a good one. Oh yeah. This is like actual legit. I'm actual drunk. <laughs> Alright, okay. Chicken. We're gonna do jerk chicken. We don't exactly have the jerk seasoning, so we will mess around with it for a little bit. I'm gonna turn the label around, but we gotta marinate for it. It smells amazing. It's from Target. It's actually not, but it's, it's Culinary Circle. That's from Target. Bullshit, Shala, son. Are you sure? Yeah. If I saw that pizza, I can prove it. <laughs> and I don't. Damn it. Yes. I'm telling you, it's from so the that Shalas. means I'm right. Anyhow, no. mm -mm. <laughs> salt and pepper your chicken. <laughs> Yo, do you want me to while I get the pan ready? Yep, go for it. Add a little bit of oil as well Listen for Favoro. That's including getting the pan ready. Salt, and then pepper. And I go for a little bit of chili powder because everybody fucking loves chili powder. <coughs> Except for Shannon. 
it is too bad. Push it in there nice and deep. You're gonna want those. I will. You're gonna want those I'm eventually. Figure it out. So. Okay. All right. We good. We good. Hey. We made it. We made a dry rub. I mean, it's nothing spectacular. Nothing over the top. But this is gonna bring all the rest of the flavor to it. Now it's just like anything else. You uh, put it on a little bit liberally, and then and then rub it into the chicken itself. Now I put it into the meat, and then when it's on there, oh shit, move around the uh, move around the middle. Yeah, I, I got it. Don't worry. Like, got sidetracked for a second. I threw uh, I threw the rest of the stuff that's supposed to go onto the bare side as it's going, which is kind of dangerous, but hey. Why would you even drink without being dangerous? Oh my god, that smells amazing. It smells wonderful, but don't breathe it in too quickly. Just like you did on the first side. Salt. Pepper and chili powder. Oh my god, that smells good. Ow. Okay, let me go. Okay. He's badass. I'm, I'm a little crooked. So. Mm-hmm. Mm. Is it good? Yep. Basically, you don't want to touch any type of meat that you're trying to sear for the first 30 seconds. I, mean, I don't care what it looks we're like. Yeah, we're about a minute right now. I don't care if shit's starting to set on fire. Perfect. That one's perfect. Look at that guy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. So you move them all over. You cut the heat down. Very important. And then, beer. We haven't done corn in a while, so I'm gonna have to just. Wait. I have no fucking idea what we're doing. Go, go. So I can bite go. it. Go, oh, come on. Crunchy. Too crunchy. It's done. Too okay. It's All done. Right. Call it a day. All right. We're gonna take it off though, so we want to keep cooking. Be good. Take it out and we'll strain it just like you would pasta. Let's do this. You want to help me out with this? Yeah. Oh, whatever. Here we go. Aerial shot. Oh, that's hot. Thanks, John. Yeah, it's not really. All right, here, let's put it right back in. Ready? Like that. Put it over there. Stays warm. Bam. Wop, 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 wop. To the chicken. We're going to add butter. Whoop. We're going to use a little bit of cream. Butter. to thicken up the sauce. And Ooh, that's hot. we got some uh, Calypso sauce. I don't know what that means, but it says uh, picante on it, which is Spanish for spicy or possibly hot. I'm not certain. I'm pretty sure their language is gibberish. You're just yeah, out to insult issue. everyone, aren't you? We have a bit of an issue. Yeah. I got the ribs again. The French fries. They're not, going, they're not going on the cooker. No, bake them. Okay, well, we'll have to empty the. Yeah. So. All right. Well, first, why don't you get a shot of this, and then I'm gonna cover it, and then we're gonna let it cook the rest of the way. You have that? Mm-hmm. Not just me scratching my balls. <laughs> All right. Okay. All right. So cover. And let cook and mix it around every once in a while. Okay. John, give me some tinfoil, dude. Uh, yeah, where's that? Uh, you behind you, side. Draw. That one, draw right, that one. Oh, fake. 
That's what I wanted to do. Big start. Bank is already on, dude. I already have a preheating. Well, I wanted to start it again. <laughs> Stupid. Okay. Are we having a test from the emergency? Yes, we are. Jenny, yeah, move. I'm just kidding. Look at it. Right. I'm pretty sure lost is what's gonna happen to us. We're gonna land on an island. The tornado is gonna pick us up because we have tornadoes in Massachusetts now, apparently. My pants are falling down. Oh, you wanna describe why all of a sudden randomly, like 70 percent through the episode, we're talking about ribs? All right, you know what? Yeah. Uh, so, the other day we got ribs at Longhorn, which I'm about to get hired at, and subsequently fired when they see this. See this. Yeah. Uh, they got some ribs for us, and we have some leftovers, so we're going to cook them up as leftovers. So that's what Eddie's working on the side right now, which is pretty Eddie's awesome. Eddie's a slut. He works the main oven, 350, we're heating up the, uh, the leftover ribs. The spare little cooker thing we got in the corner, uh, we got the fries going to get them crispy again because okay. don't microwave those, nasty. Oh yeah, they get disgusting. Anytime you have something that's like, let's say fried or anything like that, you don't want to throw them in the, in the microwave because it falls apart, it's disgusting. Worst comes to worst, throw everything in the oven because it dry cooks stuff instead of wet cooks and makes it disgusting. Yeah. Oh dear. Yeah, that's gonna be good and hot and you're gonna be excited. Pooing fire. <clears throat> yeah, I know. We're not gonna do it to your food. <laughs> Women. Women hate good food. We should state that now. Cheeky bastards like this guy. Yeah, I'm fat, which means I know what good food tastes like. I'm oh getting shit. There. <laughs> Look at ourselves on this episode, and then like our very first one. To oh, down. No, it's oh, getting no. so much worse. Oh, okay. That's what I was saying. Oops. Salt, butter, and oil. Just throw it on top. It'll be fucking awesome. For someone and I've been into, a, I can affirm this. Who cares? And pepper. You need pepper on all of these while we're rolling, right? Mm -hmm. We'll just turn up the heat because it's a little thin. And uh, when you have cream or butter in anything, when you turn up the heat, it, it boils out a lot of the water liquid and it gets thick by itself. But worst comes to worst, we'll either add some more butter, add some flour. Flour usually adds a, a, a like a dry floury taste, but when you add a lot of fat to it at the same time, it just thickens everything and doesn't give it that shitty taste. Stick to your bones. Where's my beer? Oh, dude, this is gonna be the greatest day ever of food. Scoreless at the end of the first. Son of a bitch. Hey, whatever, they're not up. This is true. It's true, but the Bruins have zero offense right now. It's a straight up kick in the dick. Shot of cream? What? You. Well, I'm eating a cookie. Ow. Pass it. Yeah, Alright, or don't. Flour. It needs flour. What's the thing? Uh, white Russian? White Russian is uh, solely vanilla. It's vodka, Kahlua, and cream. Okay, I was gonna get there. I know, I know. I'm sorry, I just remembered because I was watching Big Lebowski the other day and that's all he drank. 